What's up guys, it's Ninkofish1000 and I have a stag beetle attached to my finger and it's pretty cool, he's a reddish brown stag beetle, the scientific name is written there I don't even want to try to say that, Pseudolocus capreolus okay well either way these guys are pretty sweet they're rather common in my area and they feed on tree sap and this is their adult form uh, their pincers are very they hurt if they pinch you. It's not fun. Um, I speak from experience as I put my finger in their pincers. They have pretty cute eyes. Sorry about that. My tendonitis is like my fingers are trembling. Um, so let's see if I can get them off my finger for some better contrast. This kind of fits in nicely with the theme I've had going, kind of the life cycle of a beetle with those microbes and the pupa, uh, them being in their pupa form. And this is presumably their adult form because they're quite common. Let's see if we can get this. Oh crap, no, don't bite me, don't bite me. No, be a good beetle. Oh crap. Okay, this is interesting. Ah, he's angry. I'm kind of counting on the fact that he thinks my finger is a twig or something, so he's hopefully not going to bite me. Okay, well, he refuses to get off my hand. That's fine, I guess. Get some more shots. Yeah, these things don't come off. Give me a second here. Peel. Ow. Ow. Well, this gives me a chance to show you something. Uh, the structure of their feet, they're hooked. And these guys are not very good at walking on flat surfaces. However, if you have something round, they will stick to that and you will not be able to get them off. And these are, they're also very good at sticking to screen. Because these things just dig into your screen windows or whatever. Or doors or whatnot. And they're hard to get off.